My name is Dallas, so it's a guy online, obviously, as Bioacid. Guys, today is the big day, I guess. It's the start of the 4G Championships. It's currently green is all by the acid here. I'm happy to now. have Bioacid. you will be joining me from uh, sunny, sunny Austria. Is it sunny outside? It's raining today. It's God damn it, man. I, Storm's I, I forecast for the rest of the week. Yeah, I've been casting for five years now, from 2009 is when I started. I'm actually an industrial radiation technician. That's what I do for an actual living. Of course, gaming is a massive hobby of mine. Guys, that's going to be about it. For now, I'm going to catch you guys live on MLG.TV, though, for the Call of Duty Chance 2014. I am so pumped. Can't wait. I'll see you there. The hardest challenge I've ever faced, I guess you could say, it may have been my first LAN. I'd never done a LAN before, obviously. I had only cast it at home. It sort of is the same sort of scenario, though, to me, because I was always looking into the camera. There were people there in the audience who could hear me and see me, obviously, but it was just something different that I'd never done before, you know. Some people are scared of change. I wasn't, I embraced it. I'd never done it before in my life. I was sort of worried, will it be okay? Luckily, I somehow managed to survive and the community really embraced me. Greetings all, by B Acid here at ACL Gold Coast for 2012. Here with the team of Hostile, got Raz Daddy and Scory with me. Gonna ask them little questions here or so far. Honestly, if you wanna do this, you can, but you have to focus, you know. You have to have the passion for gaming. Don't go in. You know, half ask. You want to make sure that you really are dedicated to what you want to achieve. They've got three players. One can be defusing. There's oh, one. There's two. Oh, Tyler Bobson. He sees him in the corner. He decides to hightail it out of there. Gets oh, inside. Sure. Glowing red right now. Hysteria. Uh, for Jack Poju. 20 seconds left. Hysteria now looking to think what he can oh. do here. Will he go for the real? Will he go for the fakey? It's going to be Poju out. now checking, watching out. He'll find him. Has he done it? He's shot. got it. Free wow. For Hoju, he is puffed. He is set, and he ties it back up. Two rounds. Yeah, VLOG number two coming in from LA right now. Of course, I'm here for Call of Duty Champs that is going on on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday here local time. So it'll probably start, if I had to guess, you know, early Saturday morning because it's you guys back home in Australia and New Zealand and then finish up on oh, midday Monday maybe or towards the afternoon on Monday. I'm not too sure what the time will be like in that regard. So it'll be. Hey all, Bio Boo Hassett here, and this is, I guess, Bit of a curveball for a lot of people, they didn't really see this coming. Um, I have been thinking about this for a fair while now. I've I've been doing shout casting since 2009. And in that time, you know, I've, I've met so many great people. I've, For those that are close to me, know that I, I've just been struggling recently. Um, who knows, you know, six months down the track, this may all change and I may feel that drive again. I hope I do, and I know a lot of people do as well. Um, it's just right now, I don't... I don't have it, and I need to focus on other things in my life. Again, thank you all so much for the journey that we took together. I hope, perhaps, that in the future, we'll cross paths again, but at this point in time, I'm not sure it's going to happen. Bye, mate. I'm pretty new to the community, but uh, ever since I've met you, you've been so welcoming. I just wanted to say a massive thank you to Dallas for everything he's done for our community over the years. Dallas, bro, what can I say, man? You are you are the face of Oscord for as long as I can remember, mate. Man, I, I gotta thank you for all that you've done, not only for the theme, but also for myself, man. Uh, you were the person that gave me that first opportunity, never would have casted. Uh, ACL Melbourne 2013 as a 12 year old if you hadn't have, if you hadn't have, you know let me get that opportunity I, I owe you everything for where I am today to um myself and every every time I see you talking to a new player you just you're really welcoming and so nice um, I just want to thank you very much for all the time and effort you have put into this community hey Dallas um, you mean a lot more to this community than you can ever really realize you were my real first inspiration for casting and you gave me my first live experience at it. That was just such an invaluable base for me and such a huge confidence boost. Bye, uh, this is just a little thank you video. Um, I know over the last last few weeks or so you've been having a bad time and uh, you've decided to retire and completely respect your decision. Hey Dallas, this is just a quick message to say farewell Bioacid. Um, the caster. Um, but 
I don't want to say farewell to you because you're actually a really good friend of mine. I got to meet Bio uh, back in the Call of Duty Ghosts Melbourne Regional Qualifiers for COD Champs and really we just talked COD and stuff but my fondest memory is probably after having had broken his ankle or whatever it was and he was uh, on painkillers and he'd be slurring his words when he was casting. Uh, it was quite funny to watch. Bio Booyah Acid aka Dallas. He's, uh, he's the man that definitely got me into uh, Call of Duty casting or inspired me to become a caster after watching him for so many years while I played Call of Duty back in, uh, back in the 5v5 days. Dallas, we met in 2012 when I was still part of the Halo community. So you were one of the first people I ever met from Call of Duty. We've been friends ever since then and I don't even think I've been to a land that you haven't been to in the past three, nearly four years. Just know that we are always here for you. Uh, we really do appreciate everything you've done for the Australian esports scene and OzCod in general. Uh, you should be proud of yourself and, mate, we all love you. You're a brother. Uh, you gave me that chance when very few people did. And I'm always going to be in your debt for that. It's been an absolute pleasure watching him commentate uh, the hype and passion he'd bring to his casting. A lot of people would say uh, it's second to none. And I am looking forward to seeing you and catching up with you um, outside of COD. Um, I mean, we've done that in the past and I hope that doesn't stop. Um, and I hope that you don't um, let go of the people that have made your life what it is for the last six years. Watching him on GameStar and uh, with the Oz Gamer scoreboard and all that, that's uh, definitely one of the reasons I, I got into casting. And it's uh, only really fitting that he is uh, sent off with hopefully what is a extremely good uh, good video. There's not really a single chance in hell that our community would be taken remotely as seriously as it has been today if it wasn't for your just tireless solo casting and everything you've done and the image and the professionalism that you brought to our streams. It's good to see how much you've tried to make it grow and we're really going to miss you a lot, dude. Just having the guy in casting in general is awesome. Uh, you're much loved, Dallas. Uh, you got so much support, so many people there for you. Uh, you're going to be sorely missed, buddy. And uh, I hope everything goes well for you in the future. It's an awesome achievement to go overseas, mate, not once but twice and to experience a trip to LA with you, myself, was... Uh, I, I, I won't forget it. It was a trip of a lifetime and yeah, uh, it's it's really, really sad to see you go, but I hope to see you at more events. You're really a model for how I wanted to treat people and your selflessness and your passion is just so rare on these parts and it crushes me to lose someone that sort of shared how I feel and what I want to do with esports. We're all a big family and whatever's going on at the moment, let us in and, and let us help you through it. Um, my f phone's always open to you, my house is always open to you, if you need anything let me know. Um, but yeah, you should be extremely, extremely proud of what you've achieved um, and what you're still going to achieve. I mean, we might be old, <laughs> we might be old dads or grandpas now um, in this community, but at the end of the day, you know, we've, we're babies, really. Like, there's still, you know, decades left to achieve what we want to achieve. Uh, I'd like to thank him for everything he's done for the community, as well as, uh, obviously, does play, uh, even even donating his headset, which I, uh, I kind of feel like, fittingly, I'm using right now to uh, film this clip, so. Um, I know we don't hang as much, and I regret that, but more important than anything, you're a part of some of the best land memories of my life. I will, I will never forget one free cabs and the fun that we had. That's just that means so much. You have no idea. Even though you know on Twitter is selfie daily, that's going to be missed. Um, I do hope he can, carries on doing it, and I honestly do hope he comes back to to the casting scene. Your face has gone around the world for us, and I couldn't be more prouder to have anyone this community do that um, and yeah I hope to be there along for the ride with you mate so um, I maybe I don't want to say farewell maybe I want to say um, 
congratulations on taking this next next step in your life. Um, and I hope, you know, I hope you succeed in everything that you do. And I know you will, because you, you've done so much in the past. So. But um, really, he's a legend in the community. Bio, we love your work. Stay around, just linger on Twitter and stuff so that we know you're still all good. Hopefully, you don't uh, stop with your uh, selfies a day. It's, Brings quite a bit of entertainment, but uh, otherwise, you've been an inspiration to me and, and a lot of other casters, and um, it's all thanks to you that I decided to get into this. You have done so much for this community, not only here, but overseas as well, representing Australia, and everyone sees that, and we're so grateful for everything you've done for us. Personally, you are the most kind, giving, selfless, and genuine person I've ever met. Hey, goodbyes, I suck at him. I'm so sad to lose another member of the old guard, the old school community. Just please, I want to be drinking rum and eating ribs with the squad in LA in 2016. Please get your shit sorted and come back to us soon. And um, just good luck with your life and if you ever need anyone, I'm here for you mate. Alright, take it easy. I hope man that you can um, get better soon and hopefully we'll see you back in this scene you know, in the following months man. Take care. You're a mate, you're a great friend and I truly don't know what an event's going to be like without you but I guess we're going to find out but mate if you ever want to come back if you ever want to do anything we're always going to be 100% behind you I love you bro so take care and I hope everything gets better dude peace out and I wish you well in whatever you choose to go on and do with your life I know you'll succeed at it and I'll always be here for you bye I wish you the best of luck in your life and uh, stay classy all the best, mate. We love you. See ya. Thank you so much, man. Bye. Thanks, Dallas, for all you've done. And uh, there's only really one way to describe your time in the Call of Duty scene, and that's nice.